extend my warmest greetings to you all, fellow South Africans, because we are gathered here today to mark the official commencement of Freedom Month, a month in which we celebrate the journey we have traveled together as a nation from that important foothold that 1994 provided us. I am pleased to see in this room a very diverse group of people representing the diversity of our nation, which our diversity is our strength. I'm very happy to see cultural groups present. I'm very, see, I'm very happy to see sporting fraternity present. One of the issues that the President of the Republic emphasized is that perhaps the way we have been celebrating National Days, we have not reached out to other national groups. And therefore, as we proceed to Matosana in the Northwest for the 27th of April Freedom Day celebrations, the celebrations must not be about a day itself. It must, as, it, as we call it, Freedom Month celebrations. We gather under the theme consolidating and sustaining our democratic gains. We consolidate in, uh, con democratic gains because we believe since 1994 a lot has been done to change not only the national heritage landscape of the country, but we have changed this country for the better. This we must say, notwithstanding the missteps that were committed along the way. We must speak fondly and frankly about missteps because we must not hide difficulties and challenges to our people. There is therefore a reason to celebrate because the great strides have been made since 1994 and while it will be impossible to enumerate all of them, I think it will be important nonetheless that we foreground some of the most notable ones. We cannot say we are free if most of our people are denied the most basic, the basic of services necessary improving their general quality of life. 